Well, almost from the very day that our schools had to close last month because of the coronavirus, the school districts around central New York have been providing meals for the children and their families who simply can't go without. And on top of the North Syracuse Central School District's grab-and-go services offered Monday through Thursday, the North Syracuse Education Association now has come up with another strategy. News Channel Live's Julia LeBlanc joins us live outside the union office right now. Morning, Julia. Tell us about this special effort in North Syracuse schools. Good morning, Dan and Jennifer. Well, those with NSEA have been raising thousands of dollars. In fact, they've raised $3,000 so far in working with Anna's Food Pantry in Cicero to host pop-up food banks. Um, and yesterday, they, they held their third pop-up food bank. And though this parking lot is pretty empty right now, I can tell you within minutes of the start of the event, it was packed full of families and need. And let's go to that video right now so you can see exactly what I'm talking about. So teachers and teaching assistants volunteer their their time and money to get here early for those shipments, sorting the food out in bags to give to families. They're full of frozen meats, pasta, vegetables, fruit snacks, much of it bought from Anna's or donated from the community. And after teachers are done sorting out the food, they send a district wide text to parents and the cars show up, as I said, within minutes for that pickup. Now we spoke with one of the teachers and he says as educators, they want to do anything they can to help families who are now suddenly in need because of COVID-19. I think it's important for families to just take, take a pause and realize that it's time to just take care of each other, take care of your kids, uh, do what you can, and together we'll get through this and we'll be all right. Now, the pop-up food pantries are a no-questions-asked service. I was here yesterday, and one man pulled up and said, I need some food for my elderly neighbor. That man, of course, was a parent in the district, and he wanted to help his neighbor out. Now, they're looking to do this every other week if they can, as long as the supplies last. And we also want to mention that the North Syracuse Central School District is still providing grab-and-go meals Monday through Friday at their district offices and schools throughout the district. Live in North Syracuse, Julia LeBlanc, News Channel 9.